here in Taos, New Mexico, this beautiful river. And uh, as I was driving over here, I was watching the live footage from North Dakota. And what's happening up there right now is they, they enclosed the peaceful protectors and they were drawing weapons on them and they were dropping canisters of an unknown liquid from the sky and then they cut up all uh, video footage. So that's happening right now and I'll be driving up there tomorrow. So just wanted to take this time to say a prayer for those people. May they be protected. May the whole world see the truth of how this government is addressing people who are just protecting their water and their rights. And I hope that that this whole stand can just help to like change the tides of this world of these like powerful greedy money hungry and destruction oriented forces confronting these like family spiritual prayer protection oriented people and i just i'm really grateful to be able to be part of this movement right now and i just really pray that it can be done peacefully and that no one has to get hurt so i'm gonna do a song for the water and for their protection. The drum is really, really dry. that wherever you are today that you pray for the water that you take a stand against any threat to this incredible planet that we live on unfortunately everywhere in the world there are places you can go and you can pick up trash you can talk to local businesses about the chemicals that you use you can look at the own materials that you use like styrofoam and plastics and this idea of disposable forks and knives and cups and just change the way that you behave in this world because the change has to start with you and when it starts with you, then that's going to ripple out to the people immediately around you. And if all of them change, then it's going to reach them and on and on. Because this is not just about being in North Dakota. This is not about being on the front lines uh, in like an international stand. It's about doing it within your own home, your own town, your own city. And really calling on the leaders that are supposedly representing the people to seriously do their job. And if they're not willing and able, then to get them to leave office because that is a democracy. And right now we live in a plutocracy. So that needs to change. So look in your local area, start small, and allow that ripple to continue out around the world. And let's just continue praying because that's a powerful force that no helicopters or tanks can even approach. So please pray for the water, pray for the water protectors, pray for the earth guardians everywhere.